Um, this work behind my back is called Spectres of Play and I went to a very small town called Richmond. There's an amazing, an amazing um, art gallery there called the MAP Modern Art Projects and they also offer residencies. Um, for students and I went with the university students and um, well I've made um, the first day that I was there um, I discovered an old rubbish dump um, and then I started digging and scavenging objects. The philosopher Jacques Derrida um, he wrote a book called Spectres of Marx where he argues that um, in capitalist systems there's always a bit of a shadow um, and um, he recalls marks in it and I've, made, I've titled this work um, Spectres of Play because inside these objects that I discovered and I've dug out you can see the history of consumerism and colonialism in South Africa and um, one of the work, uh, works include toilet paper dollars um, they are printed dollars sold to very poor people in Richmond. It's a very impoverished community and um, the, the toilet paper, it's a bit of a, a shocking thing to sell um, printed dollars um, because it's wishful thinking nobody will ever be able to afford um, a dollar in um, in, in, in impoverished communities. I'm not saying they will never be able to afford um, that, but it, it's a bit, uh, a bit senseless to flaunt wealth um, in such a way and, it's, uh, and, and gaining from it, from people that buy, making money by flaunting wealth, uh, that's a bit ironic. One of the works um, at the back um, is interactive. It's got a magnetic wand um, in the work and um, I've picked up many um, objects and I tested their magnetism and it's quite interesting. The objects, objects that you think um, is magnetized are magnetized magnetized or not, um, while some other objects that you will not think um, are magnetized is indeed magnetized. And specifically, if I can show um, the one um, object comes from um, an electrical pole, um, which has been um, magnetized because of electricity. Um, and if you go to Richmond um, at the Map Art Projects, if you ever um, visited it and you open a wardrobe uh, in one of the guest rooms, you're going to find this installation. Um, I've also used old t-shirts of mine while I was um, working there. Um, I've taken old t-shirts and put that in the wardrobe and then the installation just happens. And uh, I had to leave some of my clothes there um, for the installation. Um, some of the um, drawers um, have a bit of a visionary um, component or undertone in it.